Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Coach Hook Show on Coach Hook TV. It's today, and you know what that means. It's time for another Draft League battle. This time it is Challenge Ahoy. Is that your name? Is your name Ahoy? I'm confused. I don't think that's his name. No. Nope. <laughs> uh, how do I spell Spider Rhino? Spider Rhino. Spider Rhino. What's the name on sports? Uh, it's a, I don't know. Uh, oh, there it is. Spider Rhino VGC. Found it. Found it. We got there. Okay. Okay, so some of what I thought, a couple I didn't. <laughs> um, okay. So Eel did come, Rotom did come, Zapdos did not, which makes sense, but I kind of expected nonetheless with Heat Wave. Um, no Thundy, which I also kind of expected. No Raichu is really surprising though, because Raichu literally ran my whole team in terrain. Um, so that's surprising. Pinchurch is still his likely lead. Um, which is Frost Last is my likely lead. Um, it could be Arctus Old, but I think we go Frost Last. Um, yeah, I would love to get a layer of spikes for that Togi. I didn't put as much thought in Togi as I should have. I kind of knew it was coming. I kind of wish, based on bringing the Reggie, that I'd still brought my um, um, Arctovish, but I just couldn't make it consistent enough to have hail off. Um, I need to remind myself, Regieleki. It outspeeds depending on what he's doing, but I'm gonna have to guess in this league that it's two five two. Um, I think we lead Frost Loss. It's obvious, but he's led Pinchurch in so much taunt. No, my spikes. Um, one more set of spikes. I still live a hydro pump. So I'll taunt. No poltergeist. Liquidation. He should just kill me. And he only gets one layer of spikes if it doesn't. Good. Well, three layers was more than I expected. Um, man, I brought that same frost last. It's <laughs> the fourth move changes. The other three stay the same like every week, every time it comes. Um, I think we go. Darm and see what he does. Yeah, let's go Darm. Okay, goes Rotom. I quick Stone Edge. Drop the Rotom. Eel. Darm versus Eel. Electros. Um. I didn't bring smacked in the end. Stone Edge to 60. Um, it's fine. I think we just go 
Arc dissolved if he coils, we taunt. Flamethrower's fine. It's not what we want, but it's fine. Um, I'm gonna taunt, just in case he's got funky stuff. Grass Knot. Okay, I live another flamethrower. So we have to Stone Edge. Heal. Electros. Expected Mammo to come in. I'm just gonna Stone Edge. Flamethrower. Resto Chesto. I was expecting a Volt Switch off the start, but. If I get rid of this, we're like living with Darm. Um, I kind of want to just go cure him though. Cure him on Electros. Yeah, it only does twenty. Yeah, we're just gonna go here. Based on how he's playing. Yeah. Ooh. Annoying. Not the biggest deal. Click sub. Should be able to keep that sub up. So I'm gonna roost. We're also pressure stalling at this point, which wasn't really the isn't really the goal, but you turn. Okay. That's fine. Um I have to keep in mind it doesn't really matter, but if I can win 3-0 or better, that's ideal. Um Shuffle. Who's my Babiri? I didn't bring him Babiri, that's right. Might as well see. Click Earth Power. Go Spiky Shield. Okay. Imagine if I'd subbed. Oh, I should have subbed. Yeah, that actually would have been the play. Volt Switches. Okay. Goes Eel, obviously. I don't care if you go Eel, though. Because I'm not mono. It's fine. Flamethrower. I'll go roost. He's gonna U-turn. Go Togi, take more spikes. Goes Reggie. Okay. Kirim versus Reggie Alecki. Choice specs. Ancient power. Up to 51. So, I just heard power. Okay. That's fine, though. I'm just gonna roost. I'm not even gonna bother. <laughs> I'll clip sub this time. Oh, he's got superpower. Why are you just revealing superpower now? I've got a chopple. It does like not enough. So I'm just going to sub. <laughs> mm. 
gonna roost. Iron Head probably won't kill. If they could, okay, Iron Head will kill now. I think he spiky shields. More volt switches. So now we ice beam. <laughs> he, he thinks I can't touch it still, I think. He hasn't just clicked it yet. I'm just going to go Arc Dissolve this time. Bolt out. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> Stone Edge. Fine. Snow Edge deal again. We'll hit it this time. Let's go. I don't know if he if Specs Engine Power kills. Nope. Hmm. Ooh, crit. It's fine. Just go pull, go darm. No point messing around. Arc Dissolve definitely did did some work. Uh, <laughs> so he was my counter leader originally, and I didn't have Frost Loss. Um, so I was going to lead him into Pinchurchin. Um, but uh, we ended up just uh, having the Frost Loss. I had a Nine Tails. I, I didn't super love it. Uh, nice. um, yeah, so we pick up a win. This knocks Spider Rhino out of playoffs. They were on the edge of it. Um, so we do pick up the lead there. I don't know. Did the, I'm actually curious. Um, Arc Soul was more. I think I don't think the crit on the Zero War mattered. Actually, it did because um, I was so healthy. Because um, I was spadef on the Arc Soul. It was mostly just make it so they can't bolt switch around. Um, this was Mayo. Mayo never even came in. Man, Mayo never came in. I'm really surprised no alone right you. Olin Raichu was a real big problem that I really didn't have that much for. Um, I ended up going Assault Vest on Mamo, super bulky, because it was the only thing that could take a hit there, and same with Arc Assault. Um, even uh, Mega Bama couldn't really take hits well um, from Olin Raichu. It, uh, it could put, I mean, if it got a nasty plot up, it kind of just rolled everything, even with what I brought. Except for maybe Kiram, I think, in the end, lived one because of the Chopple. But, like, yeah. Um, never saw Ironhide click by Toki D either. I don't know. I'm. Spider Run was learning um, in Draft League, too, so some of the stuff isn't going to make sense to me, and that's okay. Um. Yeah, that's unfortunate that they thought Ancient Power was banned. Um, it definitely... Uh, they brought some cool stuff this season, though. Like They brought the level 1 Togi D with Shell Bell Endeavor, which is cool. Um, 
dude to it's definitely interesting yeah hmm. curious um i don't have too much else to say there um i believe that means we are the third seed going into playoffs unless one of the top two has a bad loss they'd have to lose like 4-0 or more um to drop down to us 4-0 and 5-0 or more um respectively um, so I think that we're pretty well locked in for third here. Um, putting us just a couple differential points ahead of um, Golden Run Glyscor. Um, so that means we're going to have... There are only one point difference between them, either the Poison team or the Fairy team. So we'll have a rematch either way with one of those. I believe there's a week off before the playoffs um if i remember correctly but both those matchups are interesting um both those could definitely go either way so uh i do have a preference um but we'll have to see how their battle shake up there i've got the same record with only one differential point between them i don't know who uh heck they might even play each other i don't know no um fairy plays water poison plays dreadnought who i don't remember the dreadnought is bug so yeah, it's too tough to say. There's no real auto matchups there. Um, yeah, so we'll see how it goes. Um, been on a winning streak, obviously. Lost my first one here. And between this and the other battle, other, other league, we've won... What's that? Seven plus 11 straight, I think. No, 13 straight, I think. Someone can check my math, because I don't remember for sure. But, uh, yeah. Darn picks up a couple kills. Did Kiram actually get a kill? I don't think it did. It sat on the field for like an hour and a half. But I don't think it actually got a kill. Um, it was in, It's in second place in the kill leaderboard going into this week. I wasn't really trying to feed it kills or anything. Probably could have, but... Uh, just played it safe. Burn was slightly annoying, but like, who cares? Um, it would have been nicer not to be, but... Yeah, because it didn't take out any of you, right? No, because I went to Zolt before uh, before they started dropping. And Zolt. Zolt got two. Darm got two, which was Darm got three. And then Frost lost. Frostlass <laughs> took down another one with Destiny Bond. I think every kill Frostlass has this season is Destiny Bond. I think it has like five kills. <laughs> uh, somebody played around it. I can't remember who it was. They were just like, yeah, I'm not falling for that. Uh, I want to say that was Pluto. Uh, <laughs> which just like, nah, nah, sorry. <laughs> I'm not falling for that. Um, we definitely done Dusty Bond a lot. <laughs> oh, Frostlass. You never make it past turn five, but you know, you do your job. Um, got a bit stalling in the middle, but overall, good game. Have a great day, everybody, because Coach O.